Hey folks, good day from Ireland, Jonathan Power is my name. When you're using Beaver Theme or Beaver Builder, I was wondering when you create the templates for the pages and your blog post that the templates don't show up in the default uh, admin here in the in the post screen in WordPress. So I was on to the guys in support and they pointed me in the right direction to do this. It's quite straightforward really, it's less complicated than I'd originally thought. So what we want to do is we'll go into builder team layouts add new we'll call it template testing team layout it'll be singular add team layout all singular publish launch page builder I'm just because you have your field connections now to your pages and posts I'm just for the example I'm just going to use the featured image from the page to show this so we want uh, I think it's on automatically on the featured image anyway so just save that save it's on publish so we want to go back need to get the ID now of it so when we go to team layout template testing and then when you hover over edit in the the id the number of it, of the template comes up in the url it's 44 if you look in the bottom left hand corner of the screen there so we need to create our file for the template now in the child theme we're using the child theme so it doesn't get overwritten i'll put the code for this in the comments on the video so people will have it there so I'm just creating a new file PHP file in sublime text paste we'll put the name that will come up in the WordPress admin here we'll call it template template one and then we'll have it on pages and posts so we'll put that there and then the the ID goes at the bottom here we want to template test and edit it's 44 go back to sublime text 44 goes there i'll save this now into my child theme and you need to create an individual file for each template that you create as well so it's the same procedure over and over again i'll just save that when i go back here now i said that it's in pages and posts so when i go new page and there it is template one so if I select that, do you remember with the field connection, I connected it to the uh, featured image of the post it was. So testing one, I think I have a page already called testing one. I'll just put a hyphen in. Testing one, we need to select our template one, set featured image. And then when I publish and view the page, see there it is that our field connection for the featured image so i said that it's on pages and posts so if we go down to our template here template one is here but say that i either want it on pages or posts so it's quite straightforward really in the template post type it says page and post if i take out post there and just leave it at page or vice versa for to keep it on posts and not pages go back now and refresh and it'll be gone from posts see it's not there now so that's it folks hope you enjoyed the little quick uh, tutorial i think it's a super feature really brilliant that uh, it really simplifies the admin for your clients can really do fascinating stuff there bye for now